Today we're going diving at the spot that has this really amazing cave. The way the light shines down through it is just so incredible. It's not exactly easy to get down here and I really wanted to make sure that we got the perfect shot so I made Brittany swim down like four times. Eventually she was getting tired of it but I swear the lighting kept getting better and better. When we went down for the last time, finally everything came together. This cave is so magical and I can't wait to come back again. Okay, that's all the stuff we saw. Bye. times but it was definitely worth it today the water is so glassy that it literally looks like a lake which is so rare on an island in the middle of the pacific ocean so anyways i'm going diving with Brittany, and there's this little cave spot that we're going to and it's so cool to be down on the sand but surrounded by these big reef structures i had to bust out the big camera and get this cinematic shot of her throwing up the sand and then wrapping around her while she looked up at the cool reef next we went through this tunnel and at first it looked like we were all alone but then Let's wind it back and you can actually see there's two scuba divers in here. Talk about a traffic jam. The next tunnel that we're going to go through is the best one yet. So come back later if you want to see it. Today, Brittany and I are going diving at this spot that uh, normally has water, but thanks to historically low tides, there's barely any water here. It actually made it really hard to get out through the rocks, and we pretty much had to climb over them like a freaking frog. I stayed here to watch Brittany just in case she got pounded by the waves so I could get a funny video of her. She made it out safely, and we're hitting up these tunnels that are so cool. The light shines down through the holes in the tunnel, and it gives it this really amazing spotlight effect. I waited for her down at the bottom of this one, and when she swam through through it, you could see all the beams of light shining through the holes. I swear this fish hanging out at the perfect spot in the hole is not a paid actor. These tunnels are so much fun to dive through and I love being able to come out here on a calm day. Okay, that's all the stuff we saw. Bye. So normally we gear up right here and then swim out through that way and you can see even the the high water line, like where the red goes to white on the rock and all the high white is like where the water normally is. And now it's down here.
Sorry, I had to stop to film you in case something funny happened. So we all know that Brittany is pretty much a master of blowing bubble rings, but uh, even the masters need to keep up with their practice and apparently Brittany hasn't been practicing very much because she tried to blow three in a row and none of them turned out. Pretty disappointing Brittany. I had to remind her how it's done so I went down and blew three perfect ones in a row. Okay well I blew three in a row and one of them was perfect so that's good enough. Then Britt was like alright that's enough of the jibber jabber I'm gonna show you how it's really done and she blew one perfect one and then another one and the second ring shot through the first one. Um, excuse me, you're just gonna bust out the ring tricks like that? You don't have to flex on me in my own channel, Brit. Okay, that's all the stuff we saw. Bye. Why zero? Trick shot. Oh, did you see what I did? Yeah, it was really cool. It went through and then it stayed. Oh yeah. It like became its own. It went through and was still a ring. Yeah. Break. Yeah, that was awesome. That was really cool.